This is what running in shoes looks like to most people. The heel creates a pronounced heel stripe in a straight leg landing using excessively cushioned soles and motion control. Compare it with bare feet running, and you will notice that people bring their gravitational axis forward and produce less of a heel stripe. It creates a flat foot stripe, cushioned by muscles and knee flex. When you run bare feet, you adjust your running style to reduce impact and utilize your body naturally. The running is also less bouncy. Clearly the latter we've developed over millions of years to match who we are. Running shoes which go against this running style have been developed the past 30 years. From empiric academic research, we know that this has not had any positive reduction of running injuries. Now we produce shoes which help you mimic the movement of barefoot running, but still offer you sufficient protection. You roll on the heel, go down to the forefoot with less impact, and let your foot muscles and toes propel you forward naturally. It pushes more of the weight outside on the foot, which in turn is simply more natural. Seen from the side, the foot shows less and slower forefoot falling. With a flatter foot strike, you create a faster transition to a stable position. The flexibility of the shoe allows your foot to activate more muscles and it results in an altogether more powerful push-off. When seen from the rear, the heel shows less and slower inwards falling. Looking at your overall posture, you place your foot more centered under your body whilst running. And here is the shoe. It offers just enough support to protect against hard surfaces. It is flexible to activate your foot and lower leg muscles.